everybody welcome back to my kitchen welcome back to my channel welcome back to my live you see me you know who it is thank you for joining me for another episode of keep cooking with lee i'm lee in case you didn't know yep here she is i be she and today as you can tell by the title i am going to be making for you guys a chicago hot dog air fryers wow. this menu item was inspired by my husband he had to have that chicago hot dog i said why not make this hot dog for you guys in his honor and his memory hope he's looking down i know he's looking down and he's happy with what i'm continually doing and i just want to thank you guys for continually joining me and just stay on this journey with me we're gonna be all right so without further ado let's get right into the ingredients y'all ready Lego. And we're back. We have our wonderful ingredients, some yellow mustard, half a cucumber, some tri-colored peppers, a little red onion, some Roma tomatoes, two buns. We have some dinner hot dogs. Those are from Costco Kirkland Dinner Hot Dogs. Guys, if you never had hot dogs before in your life, you gotta get those Kirkland hot dogs. Or use your favorite hot dogs. Some people like hot men, some people like ballpark, but those hot dogs from Costco, you never had a hot dog until you had those. Anyway, let's get back to the ingredients. We've got two uh, kosher dill pickles. And that right there is all you need to make the Chicago hot dog. I've seen it several ways, but this is the way um, we had it. So I just looked up a recipe for it and it was close to the one that we had, me and my husband had when we visited Chicago. So I said, let's go with this one. So without further ado, let's get into it. Okay, first thing we're gonna do is chop up our vegetables. As you can see, these are just frozen peppers that I got from Trader Joe's, guys. So we're gonna set those to the side. You can use fresh ones, but I'm trying to do things a little bit easier here. So we're gonna cut up our already washed cucumber. I like to leave the skin on, so I'm not gonna cut the skin off. You can, if you don't like the skin, you can chop it up. And cut it up whatever way you want, but this is how we're gonna do it. Just move that to the side. I'm just gonna dice up your cucumber. Like that. Let's get our vegetables cut up. Put that to the side. slices some nice slices that's that we're not going to use this one we're only making two hot dogs so i'm going to put this one away all right you see that and that's that so we got our vegetables all cut up and ready we're going to go right to the air fryer and start our hot dogs Almost forgot about the pickles, guys. I'm gonna slice those in half. And again, if you're not crazy about kosher dill pickles, use whatever pickle that you like. And there you see it, those are all of our toppings. And now the next thing that we're going to do, it's a lot of coloring, I love it. It's gonna be a beautiful hot dog. Next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna throw our hot dog in the air fryer. This video is gonna be very, short guys this is just a quick meal a satisfying meal and i hope you guys enjoy it so let's get to it i'm pretty excited about it okay here we are in our air fryer i want to make for easy cleanup so i'm going to line the air fryer just one basket easy cleanup. i could actually put the hot dogs in this but i want to make it as easy as possible i don't want to don't really feel like cleaning this up so you can line it with foil or you can actually drop drop the hot dogs in without it okay 
400 degrees on 10 minutes. And these hot dogs are not frozen, so that's why we got them for 10. Clock number one, clock number two. Pop that baby in. Start right up. We'll be back. Stay tuned. Don't go nowhere, stay right here, don't go nowhere, stay right here, don't go nowhere, stay right here, and we'll be back. Marvelous. Did you say so? Let me grab a fork real quick. You see it? You see it? It's almost just like the grill. Like we grill these. I would say these hot dogs are ready to come out. I had them in there. I initially put them in for 10 minutes, but I decided to check on them. And this is 400 degrees, which you see after six minutes. So you don't need to put them in there for. 10 minutes, six minutes is suffice. Look at that, beautiful. Almost looked like it was on the grill. That's basically it. I'm gonna throw the bun in here for about maybe 10 seconds, 15 seconds. And we're gonna go dress these dogs up with our toppings and that's it. about 20 seconds. Let's get it. color and flavor in these dogs. I'm gonna put the I'm gonna put the tongs down. Let's let's get into it and be real. I'm trying to be all fancy fied. But let's get real. Down and dirty with it. These hands are clean. They stay clean. Trust me. The hands stay clean. Alright, here's our tomato. Oh that tomato looking like it's looking. a lot. Oh my goodness, it's a lot. I'll give you a closer look. And there you have it. Your Chicago hot dogs air fryer style. I'm going to taste it up for you guys and say grace and let you know how it came out. And we are back. You can see. Give you another look. We're gonna say grace and test, taste test this for you. And we have a special guest who wanted to be on camera and taste it as well. Come on over. Hello. Who is this? I'm Katie. You remember Katie? This is Sam. We call him Katie, my grandson. And he wanted to taste the hot dog on camera with me. So, you ready to do this? Yes. What's the first thing you gotta do? Say grace. You wanna say grace for the people? Yes. Alright. God is great. God is good. Lord, we thank you for this food. In Jesus' name. Thank God. Amen. Amen. So, with time is it? Eat time. What time is it? Eat time. What time is it? Eat time. What time is it? Eat time. You ready to eat? Yeah. Alright. 
Time to eat. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna cut this in half. Okay. You wanna say anything before I get a knife? Uh, yeah, I don't no, I'm being shy again. Okay, I'm being shy again. All right, this is his true reaction. Let me get a sauce. Okay. You ready? Yeah. You wanna try it together? Yeah. All right, here we go. Mmm. Mmm. It's good. It's good. It's your favorite part. I usually don't like cucumbers, but it actually makes it taste good. It tastes good. Okay. I love all the, mm, the textures. Peppers. I'm going in for another bite. Pickle makes it good. You like the pickle too? What you do? Okay. Okay. I love it. So you heard it from the mouth of babes. Should they make it? Yeah. Should they make it? You said it. And I agree. So with that being said, that's all that we have for now. We want to thank you for joining us again. Looking forward to seeing you all on the next time. Be safe. We love you. And remember, cooking is an act of love. I'm sorry. Things that I love. You don't cook this for yourself. Cook it for someone else. Tell them what they should do. You must like, share, and subscribe. And remember, comment if you like this video. And with the bumper notifications. And remember to hit that notification button. Well, what you gonna do? Huh? What you gonna do if they don't? I'm gonna whoop you. <laughs> we love you. We out. <laughs>